What's happening YouTube? Cowboy here and we're back with more Dynasty Warriors 8. This time we're going to be pulling out one of the hottest little Chinese chickadees around, Wang Naji. We got her in the lineup for you, as well as Hang Dang and Wan Ping. So, let's uh, head on out and get those materials to finish up this Tonga Tai. I'll tell you, it feels like it's been forever since I've been on here. Just because last week I got all my recordings done in like one day. But we got our red hair now. Go around all super fast. Mm, going to be awesome. Pretty much all we're working on now is just finishing up this tongue to tie. So you guys uh, drop requests for what you want. Aside from that, we're uh, just going to be working with the requests. Oh man, look, she's tearing everything up with these throwing knives. She's dirty. She's so fast. That's probably the best part about uh, Huang Yunaji. It's like her attack rate is just so absurd. So like, even though she doesn't do a ton of damage, she's hitting so incredibly fast that the enemies just can't keep up. Look at these guys, they can't even like manage to get up to me. Aerial attack combo! Look at this guy. He's like, I gotta stop this bitch. She's like, nah, you got no chance. Why are you still alive? Right, I do. I don't want to mess with Langy Nazi. What's this last ball set? Come here, buddy. There, Musao! Super Flame Kick of Doom! And this guy really likes blocking. See what happens when I come at him with my level two sound attack. I hope you're satisfied. Still not dead? I think I'm the flame kick of death again. Boom! Oh, down he goes. Unit commander defeated. On to the next battle. But with where we're at in the, I guess, let's play for this, pretty much once we complete the uh, barracks and I believe the merchant, our Tonga Tai should be completely finished. So once that's done, unfortunately, we'll be done with Dynasty Warriors, but no need to fret. There are plenty of other games in the mix. I'm sure by now you've already seen that we have... Uh, Saints Row 4 walkthrough I must go out already at full speed ahead. In addition to that, I know once yeah, Dynasty Warriors is done, we'll be you. starting off uh, Splinter Cell Blacklist for you guys. And then you can definitely plan on seeing some Final Fantasy run. Primarily in the form of lots and lots of live streams. But that'll definitely be uh, starting off this week as well, so keep your eyes out for that. Helm red hair. Of course, is like four times her size. Just gigantic. Come on, a giant red horse. If I had a giant red horse, I probably wouldn't even like drive my car. I would just ride it around. People would be like, is that a gigantic red horse? And you'd be like, hell yeah, it is. Jelly? And they'd be like, what? no. Like, yeah. Yeah, you are, don't lie. You're mad that you don't have a gigantic red horse. Do you wish to lose to me? I hope you're satisfied. You go down. Come on, buddy. What are you doing? Stop blocking. Ah, 
gotcha. That's what happens. You try to swing at me, and you get knocked out. It's actually pretty fun. She just like sprints around, just chucking out her throwing knives and slaughtering everything in her wake. We'll end up doing it with the uh, the third mission. We'll crack. We'll uh, we'll get her rage attack in again, so you can get a better idea of what it looks like. Cause it really is a, a cool one. And then we're gonna switch things up to Hang Dang. And I haven't played him much, but from what I have played. He seems like a very strange character. Like all of his dialogue in the game is just, "Are people gonna remember me? Like I don't, I don't want people to forget who I am." And I'm like, "Dude, like, you just got introduced into this game. Nobody even knows about you yet." And he just like pouts it. I have come to assist you. I'm gonna keep blocking, I'll just have to take you out to rape you, bro. Come on. Alright, we got a nice looking group of enemies up ahead. We'll take them out with our rage attack if we can get it up in time. Because red hair already isn't fast enough. We need to add speed to it. No, this isn't the right way. Damn it. I keep missing that turn. There we go. Alright. Let's get our rage up real fast. Ooh, there's uh goodies. Yeah, we've got the materials. Actually we're gonna come back so we can actually chain it off all these dudes. We'll get our rage up here on the boss. We won't actually do it to him since it'll just end the fight. Alright, got our rage. Let's go pay these guys a visit. Ow! You hit a girl? What a dick. I must fulfill my duty. Love it. She's like a, like, just a child. She's just like ah ha 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 ha. She runs around chucking knives at everybody. Boom! And a massive kick. Boom! Threw all away. Wow, that was the unit commander. He chased me all the way out here. Not that bright of a move, bro. Could have stayed alive if he didn't come out chasing me. Zhang Liao looking all badass. He's like, I got this. You can just go take a nap. Alright, let's return to camp real quick here. Switch on in the next character in our lineup. Oh man, these load screens, they feel forever again. I uninstalled it from my hard drive to make room for Saints Row. And all of a sudden it's like... I don't know, I just feel like these uh, the screens used to be a lot shorter. I mean, maybe it's just me. But who knows? Let's see what Zhang Liao has to say. What's up, buddy? Oh, he loves me. How sweet. Right, where are you at? Dang. Han Dang. All right. Pull out some weapons. Mm, Cyclone eight. I believe that's. Oh yeah. Yeah, we'll do that for sure. And we will take out oil access as secondary. 
Accuracy, attack boost, mighty roar, havoc. You gotta give him the red hair. Alright. Heading out, be careful. Thanks, I, I got this. I don't need your, your parenting. Han Dong's a big boy. He'll be able to handle himself, no worries. Big old axe. Or excuse hey, me, it's a short fight. I have come to Boom. All of you. Super bitch left combo. Damn, that took care of him. I was like, maybe I can just block this attack, and Han Dong was like, nah, nah, you're not. I'm just gonna hit you so hard it shatters your block. Come right here. Thrust combo. Oh, that was a fun one. Did I get the material off that? Yeah, I did. this real quick. Keep on chasing me. We'll make this fun. Let's see. Well, this is EX. One, two, three, four. Okay, so it is a six level. Only one left. Let's give him the moose out attack. Don't miss with me. Bah. Ground stomp into Super Smash. I run circles around you, Zheng Yao. More materials, more materials. So as always, make sure to request for the upcoming episode. As I said, we're wrapping up on Dynasty Warriors, so want to try and get all those other requests you guys still have in. I know we have uh, Madai up in the next episode. And aside from him, I don't think there's been any additional requests. Actually, there was one for Nunchucks, I believe, so we'll probably end up um, working that in. We'll just use Wan, whoever. I think, I don't remember if Wan Ping is the Greatsword or the, the Nunchucks. Either way, we'll just we'll yank out uh, whatever child Wan you has at the Nunchuck level. I think that's one soon. So we'll do him and Madai in the next episode. And one other character of the Whoever that may be. I really like his level 5 charge. It's pretty sweet. Like does some work with that. Where are you going, you? Commander, I ain't done with you. I'll take on all of you. Get smashed, bro. No chance. wants to get smashed. I'm gonna grab this. Should be another one. Oh, there it is. Grab that guy. Let's get a good view for this one. Don't miss with me. Not bad. Kind of kind of a 
I guess, commonplace for a Musou attack, but not not half bad. Let's see what his ground one looks like. Right, I have a feeling I was supposed to grab somebody with that. <laughs> we killed the unit commander and it bugged out before we could finish him with it. That's that's pretty funny. All right, let's try and get the air Musao and the regular Musao, as well as the rage in this time around. We'll see if we can get them all. I mean, it's it's not my fault that Han Dang kills stuff so fast. We're on hard. I mean, aside from kicking it up to chaos, and if you saw the earlier parts in the series, you remember what happened when Lu Bu tried chaos at uh in the wee early 30s did not end well at all. Actually, I got an idea. Hey, Let's see what, um... Look, it's Han Dong. He's famous. One of these... Triumph Rage Gauge. Okay, so there is uplift on this axe. It's not bad. I have come to assist you. Take a lot more to get this gauge all the way up. Could just keep beating on the dead guy, but seems a little redundant, right? And with four we jump. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, here we go. Another boost out. All right, buddy. Come here. You're mine. Apologize at once. So he mounts him, headbutts him, throws him up into the air, and then smashes them down with his axe. That's certainly an interesting one. wondering why I'm beating on enemies that are already dead. You can uh, you can still earn Musao even after an enemy's health bar has been depleted, so I'm just trying to get that last uh, one more bar for the third Musao attack in the rage before everything's finished up, but I mean there's a lot of enemies here, as long as I don't accidentally kill the general. Wait, man, I'm not trying to kill you yet. That's enough of that. I have other things to do. He really wants it. I will be remembered. Take this. Huh. It's an interesting one. Let's try it in front of more enemies and see how it pans out. Axe out. And then I guess he just runs and punches everything. That's kind of lackluster. Come on, buddy. You're not gonna beat me. It's not trying to block. Another three down. Back to camp we go. Wonder if Jang Liao is gonna tell me he loves me again. Be kind of awkward this time. He'd be like, Wang Yunaji, you suddenly grew a goatee. And you're much more masculine than before, but my, my love of you hasn't changed. And you're like, no, no, Zhang Liao, it's, it's somebody else. It's not Wang Yunaji anymore. And he's like, oh, oh, okay then. Wan Ping. 
Yeah, okay. One ping is the great sword. Uh, which one do we want? Let's see. Lower the health, more increases, somersault, and chains. Yeah, I like that room blade. Let's pull that one out. Zer edge, that works for me. And a fortune hunter. No, we don't need fortune hunter. But have it gone there. Red hair. Alright. Let's take our great sword on out and whoop some ass. And actually, let's. I keep forgetting to send people out on the barracks. Sure. Go, troops. like the greatsword. Which it's still good, but I do miss the, the older greatsword. I mean, back in Dynasty Warriors 3, when you played like Fuzi, the greatsword was so freaking strong. It was just awesome. Like your level 3 attack, the guy would like throw it up into a like parrying position and then stab the guy like three times with it and then do like a full 360 with it and just slice everybody up. So awesome. Give this battle everything I've got. Is that a chest already? Oh man. This time these are two materials just waiting for me. One. Now you've done it. Two. Awesome. Back up, bro. Before I oh, that's kind of a dumb single charge. Yeah, like one ping just seems a lot slower with the greatsword than the other guys did. Match your level three charge is just a hits him with the blunt of it. Like, come on. Coming in too slow with that. And like a lazy big slash. Like, ah, I'm just gonna, I gotta hit everything with this. Ugh, let me just swing it. Throw my own body weight and almost fall down. I mean, it's definitely a more realistic usage of the greatsword, because you're certainly not wielding something this big around to be as an altar, but I miss the old, you know, unrealistic usage of it, since Dynasty Warriors. Like, you know, in ancient China, there was not some, like, Wan Ping, the actual person, he was not running around with a sword this big, killing everything. He just wasn't. I don't care where you think he, where you, you know, read that, like, oh no, he, he was, it's true. No, he was not. I promise you. Tornado style. It's kind of fun. Again. Super Tornado! Super giant slash. Works. Pretty much just killed everybody in front of me. I'll take it. I have a feeling that his new sour attacks probably aren't all that stupendous. It's probably that big slash. I'm sure the, the aerial one is just like, he just slams it to the ground and hurts a bunch of stuff. I'm trying to remember what the third back in DW3 what it was. I'm pretty sure you just spun around with it just slashing people and then ended it with like uh, something similar to the the three charge in this game. I don't know. It was quite a long time ago. Give this battle everything I've got. I have come to assist you. That's right. I got a great sword, and I'll do an aerial flip with it. Don't, don't try me. I can definitely do that. Don't you do aerial flips when you're wielding swords the way the same amount as you do? I thought everyone does. Actually, it might not even be worth calling red hair over here. It's only like two more little groups of guys, and I'm there. Tornado! It's 
Right here gonna reach me in time. Oh, oh yeah, yes. Good job, right here. Drop me off right here. I'll take care of it. Let's try our aerial moose out on this guy. Okay, so it's Braver Slash from Final Fantasy. Nice, two warriors running out of ideas, I guess. I'll take Braver. I mean, it was a pretty sweet limit break. The first time you did that in Final Fantasy VII, you were like, Oh my god, special is so freaking awesome! And then, like, down the line, you get Omni Slash, and you're like, Holy shit, Braver is completely terrible compared to Omni Slash. The first, still, the first time you do it, it's still it's pretty awesome. Right. Yeah. Let's try to level three. That was like the same thing as the first Musao, except he just spun in the other direction. <laughs> oh, one ping. We got one more. I definitely want to want to get into a situation where I can do his first Musao, followed by his third, to like get a better comparison on them, because it looked like they were literally identical. There's someone I should pull out if I, if uh, we don't get any requests. I'll probably pull Wei Yan out for the Wednesday episode, because he is all kinds of fun. I mean, he's definitely one of the stranger characters, but he's just incredibly fast, and the way he chains combos together is just disgusting. He's such a powerful character when he's used right. Give this battle everything I've got. How red hair is just like walking into the middle of everything, like, hey, I'm gonna, I wanna fight too. Like, can you not stand there, red hair, please? We're fighting here. Good job, get away. It's like he just wants to be on the screen. He's like, everyone should look at me. I'm big and red, and you played a hundred, I played 90 battles to get him, but it's part of a hundred battles. Die. Stubborn unit commander. Oh, I'm just kidding, buddy. We got speed boots. Let's stay back here. Don't need you walking in front of the camera, fogging up everyone's view. second there I thought that was like the unit commander I had to kill and I was like why is he here already? Stop blocking man! I feel the wrath of my tornado greatsword spell. more time. This is our level three. I shall do my best. So it's just like two consecutive slashes, I guess, while spinning. Because the other one was more of just like a big slash, I guess. Can't believe the damn general just ran up to me like that. I figured he was like near the back where all the, the mobile unit captains were. <laughs> oh man. Kind of sucks that he died so fast. Didn't even really get to to have too much fun with the moose owls. I mean, I suppose I can't blame him, though. When you're fighting somebody that's wielding a sword the same size as you, it's kind of hard to not die when it hits you immediately. Like, just the sheer weight of a sword that big. It, it wouldn't even be that the sword would cut you. It would just be that the, the weight behind a weapon like that effectively would just, like, crush you instantly. Like, it would just blow right through you crush your sternum and your whole ribcage at once. Alright. Well, let's do a little camp management here. First, actually, we're gonna let's convert some more materials over. What's up, merchant man? Boom. 
see how far that gets us. Alright, so it's a merchant and barracks. Yes, alright. Let's use up merchant materials and we're up to 46. So once our merchant hits 50, then we just gotta get the barracks to 50. We're all set. And you can bet in the next video we'll end up uh, we'll end up getting the merchant all finished up. I wonder if he gives us a better exchange rate. I can't even check. Your, your animals are kind of lackluster, buddy. I thought you'd be better. I just leveled you up. Either way, though, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. As I mentioned earlier in the video, make sure to, to drop requests below for what other guys you want to see come out. I know right now on the lineup we have uh, Madai. And I think, or aside from Madai, somebody requested the Nunchuck, so we're going to pull out uh, Wan Su, I believe it is. And I'm not sure, but I think there was a request for Dong Zhou's bombs a few videos back. I was keeping a list of all these, but then it's like, I don't know, stuff just gets lost within the comments. But either way, make some requests so I have some stuff for the, the next load of videos coming out. And we'll see you guys with a new episode on Thursday.